What's up everyone, Spencer Sue here, your tech realtor of the Bay Area. Welcome to Communications Hill here in San Jose. Now most people local in the area know this area because of its infamous grand staircase right behind me. However, there is a lot more history of the area and how did it become what it is today? These large scale developments here in the area don't happen very often. So let's take a look and see what's been going on over the last several decades. While the history of this area dates back to the 1700s, one of the most notable recent moves was when Manuel Azevedo started operating a dairy farm on this hill in 1916. Generations later, the Betancourt family, who are descendants of the Azevedo family, has been working with the city of San Jose since the 1980s on the hill's development, but the actual construction didn't start until the early 2000s. This is when KB Home created the Tuscany Hills community, which is where I stand today. This area spans 740 residential units. After that, another large developer, which is Summerhill Homes, built 400 homes in the adjacent area of Derry Hill. However, construction halted for a long time during the Great Recession, and it wasn't until 2015 that KB Homes resumed construction. Nevertheless, once it got going again, there were plans to build over 2,700 homes. KB Homes is wrapping up phase two at this time, as phase three is gonna be the, one of the most exciting times for the area, as that is when 15,000 square foot of commercial space and 31,000 square foot of amenity space will come to existence. This area is called the Village Center. In addition to the commercial space being built, there will be another 1,300 plus units to be added. So what kind of properties are available here? If you prefer the early developments of the Tuscany Hills, you can get a traditional Mediterranean style home. If you want more of a contemporary look, the newer construction type homes will be perfect for you. The beauty of this area is that you will find properties of all types. Whether you're looking for a one bedroom condo, which starts at $540,000, to a four bedroom single family home at $1.4 million, there are choices for everyone. If you don't want pre-loved homes, you can also elect to choose new construction homes built by KB. They have all sorts of homes to choose from. Reach out to me directly as I love to show and negotiate the best price for you here. I hope you enjoyed this neighborhood spotlight. While a lot has been done in the area, we are only halfway through the next phases. Leave a comment below with what your favorite thing is about this community. If you are looking to buy, sell, or invest in the area, reach out to me anytime as my contact details are below. I will help you every step of the way, whether it's an existing home or a new construction home. If you like the video, hit the like button, hit subscribe, and click on the little bell. You'll be notified every time I release a new video. Thanks for tuning in another episode, Engineering a Better Life today. Thanks for making it to the very end of my YouTube video. If you like the content, please hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit that little bell as well, since it'll give you notifications of when my next episode is. If you know of anyone that is considering to buy or sell a home here in the Bay Area, I'm never too busy to help more people. Always welcome to have a conversation, regardless if you're uh, ready to go right now or if you wanted to buy five years later. Click on that calendar link and then you'll be able to book an appointment with me and love to have a conversation about your situation. In the meantime, I also do have a monthly newsletter, so feel free to hit that uh, link below and then you'll be able to get my updates, personal updates that I write once a month in terms of what is going on with the market and some of my latest activities. Hope to see you at the next one. Thank you.